Let's, let's explore electricity. We're going to discover how electricity powers our world and transforms energy in our everyday lives. First, let's look at insulators and conductors. Insulators do not allow electricity to flow through. They keep you safe from shocks. Common examples include rubber, glass, or plastic. Conductors allow electricity to flow through easily. They are in electrical wiring. Common examples include copper, aluminum, and gold. Open circuits versus closed circuits. In an open circuit, the path is broken. Electricity cannot flow through, like when the lights are off. No power goes to the device or light bulb. A closed circuit is a complete path allowing electricity to flow through easily, like when the light switch, when the light is turned on, and power connects to devices. Did you already know that about electricity? So to review, open circuits, there's no complete path, the devices does, do not work, and can be created with a switch. Closed circuits have a complete path for the electricity to flow, and the device is on or working. Energy flows through con continuously. Conductors allow electricity to flow through easily, while insulators do not. Let's look at static electricity. It's the buildup of electric charge. This happens when you jump on a trampoline and your hair stands up because of shock. Or lightning, natural static electricity is lightning in the sky during storms. It's an electromagnet. It's made of wires wrapped around metal and connected to a battery to allow electricity to flow and create a magnetic field. Some things that these can be found in are, are doorbells, motors, or speakers. Some types of energy, you see energy all around you. Mechanical energy, movement, thermal energy, the energy of heat electromagnetic energy like visible light, electrical energy that powers houses or in lightning, chemical energy when we eat food. Those foods go into our body and help us get the energy to move around. Some examples of energy transformation. When using a lamp, electrical energy is transformed into the radiant energy you see as light. When using a fan, electrical energy is transformed into mechanical energy, the moving of the fan blades. And when a toaster turns on, electrical energy is transformed into thermal energy. Hopefully, you understand these key objectives during this unit.